I want to, um, whoa, they've changed shit. What the hell is going on? Why have they moved? They've just moved stuff. They haven't even really, whatever, whatever. I have a little bit of anger, frustration built up in the system. I don't know when this video is going to go up because I uploaded a four hours video last night as I'm recording this and I have another one in the backlog still waiting. This won't matter by the time this video goes up. I'll be free as a, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be like a happy floating butterfly. It won't even matter. Right now though, look, I was, I don't get angry often. I don't really like it and I'm the kind of person who's like, I think a little bit of every emotion, emotion is, is good. First of all, you don't want to suppress the negative emotions, the anger and the sadness. That does nothing for nobody. I think you want to, you want to have a little bit of all the emotions. I think it's healthy to have a little bit of anger sometimes, a little bit of sadness sometimes, a little bit of happiness, a little bit of everything, right? I think it's healthy. I just don't like being angry. I know if I'm ever, like, mad about something, it's never, like, that serious, right? I'm never, like, angry, angry. And even then, it lasts for about 15 minutes. It's why I like sports, actually, because I can be... I can just be mad about Spurs once a week and be angry about it and then get it out of my system and then not care, and it's fine. And then the real shit doesn't bother me. Water off a dog's back, as they say. Summit today, summit today, a lot, a lot's been going wrong the past few days, little things, building up, building up, summit today that just had me, and then I restored, I restored the balance, I restored the peace, I had some fun playing some Roblox squid game, uh, it's come back, and I figure, you know what, maybe for once, maybe we don't need to push it to the side, maybe we just need to, to acknowledge these feelings, uh, uh, and figure out the best way to, to tackle them, and to, and to, and to move on from them, right? I think maybe I need to just revel in the hatred, and what makes me madder than a little bit of Fall Guys, baby? <laughs> um, so I'm ready to kill some bean people, basically, is what I'm here for. Uh, I would like to win. Here's the thing, right? I have an obligation. I'm trying to beat this game. I Someone at my new job asked me recently, fucker, you fucker. You little fucker. Okay, no, you fucking, you fucker. You absolute little piece of, you, you absolute garb. Okay, fine. That's me what games I play. Didn't mention Fall Guys. It didn't even enter my, my brain. Uh, I didn't mention Genshin either, but that was just out of embarrassment. Um, <laughs> because who would want to admit that they play Genshin Impact, right? <laughs> uh, losers. Am I right? Stinky. Uh, I really like Genshin, kind of, not really, to be honest. No, I do, but I, I like my friends, is what it really comes down to. Um, okay, good jump. Fall Guys didn't even men enter my brain. You want to know why? Because this, I, I don't come home and play Fall Guys for fun leisure time, like I would any typical video game. I'd be playing this shit because it's my duty. Like, I feel like I was, like, God gave me a mission. God put me on this earth to beat Fall Guys. Gooch dog? What? <laughs> I'm here to beat Fall Guys. That's it. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. Oh my god, I get so many notifications from every which angle. Raiders fans are real quiet this morning. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What's up? My sister's friend isn't coming to see Billy Eilish with us anymore next year. Do I know anyone who would pay £90 for the ticket? Probably not. <laughs> probably not. That's unfortunate. I probably don't. Considering I had to beg one of my friends to come see Clara with me, and I'm paying for her ticket, and I'm currently in the process of begging uh, another different friend to come see TV, TV Girl with me, and I'm also probably going to be paying for her ticket as well. Probably won't be able to convince anyone to spend £90 on a Billy Eilish ticket. So, that's a bit of a tall. That's a bit of a. Hey, if anyone watching this wants to come see Billie Eilish with me and my sister and also spend £90 on the ticket, let me know. Apparently, we've lost one. Um, people are dying. Grab a tail. Oh, it's just when people grab. Ugh, the green is fucking disgusting. Ugh. Holy shit, the green looks bad with this skin. That's hideous. Okay. Don't lose forehead. Ow. Don't lose forehead. Hello. Yoink. Oh, you fucker. The yellow stole it. Yeah, it's funny, I don't, like, I feel like I haven't done a bit for actually a month, but I don't, like, I either don't have any or, like, I've, I have them and I'm not sharing them. I, no, let me get, there we go. 
I can't tell. Part of it is just because like I tell my friends stuff and then I'm like, oh, I don't need to share them in the video because they've already like I feel like I've already told them. This fuck is trying to steal my tail. We're on the same team, idiot. If you lose this, I'm gonna be furious because I wouldn't have lost it. I would have kept that for 38 more seconds and won us the game. Hey, good job. Good job. You better not lose this. You better not lose this, you fucking dumbass. Never mind, he kept it. My bad. Yoink! I think I just stole it from my teammate and then immediately lost it. I'm the biggest hypocrite on the planet. Oh my god. If we lose, this is on me. You know what? It wouldn't have been on me if the stupid egg, which by the way has lost his tail, didn't steal it from me in the friggin' first place. Just hold on. Fuck yellow. Don't get don't don't let yellow get one. Don't get, don't get yellow got one. Okay, six no, we're fine. Over time, what do you mean? No 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 I gra I gra go No Go Let's go I don't know where the bits go. There's probably some. Maybe it's just the engine isn't running. I don't have time to think of them anymore. Why is my lighting so low? Hello? Hello? Probably because it's 7.33 p.m. That would make sense. Look, the well's dried up. It's hard because like, I don't record anymore. This is only my second video. I, I, I didn't record yesterday. I had Monday and Tuesday to record this week. And then I have six more days. I'm, I'm in for six days now. So I won't be recording until Tuesday next week, and I just did nothing. I didn't record anything yesterday. I recorded this is only my second video today. It's just it, it's difficult, man. The the oil's low. The oil's low. I'm just being honest. The oil's a little low. Thankfully, I have like a stupid stockpile because I keep not uploading anything. So I, I I will be good for the next week, and then more tail crab. Are you eating my? Uh, and then next Tuesday I'll be able to record and that's when I'll like really have to record because I'll have no other choice because otherwise I'll be out of YouTube video um, I'm thankful that I have like 80 million TikTok clips to edit so that's not an issue but I'm just you know the oil's it's running a little low it's running a little low but by the time you see this it'll be like a week from now because I already have a Fall Guys episode ready and waiting like ain't no thang yo he kind of thick though you guys see that guy's souls just now for free for free question mark Okay. 50 seconds. This is a long time to the point where it's like, we don't even like stress about it yet. Okay, we just be running. We don't even stress about it yet. Like, it doesn't even really make too much of a difference whether we have a tail or not. When it starts to become an issue is um, approximately, probably about now. Okay, no, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. You just gotta keep a good line. You just gotta keep a good line. As long as your line is equal to your opponent's line, nothing can be done to stop you. They can't be having a better line than you. This could be problematic. This could be problematic. Nope. It's all about keeping a good line. You just gotta keep an excellent line the whole way through. As long as your opponent's line. Fuck you! <laughs> Sorry, sorry, mommy, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> What's that about the pent up anger? This is why we play Fall Guys. See the shape on my face. See the shape on my face. What have I done? I've become a gamer. Oh no, I'm I've, been, I've been video gaming too much. I'm becoming toxic. I spend too much time in the Genshin community. I'm becoming a toxic individual. I'm going to be review bombing random apps on the app store. Um, uh, 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 my fitness pal, one star. The Genshin rewards were bad, boo. Right? That's what they're doing? Something like that? Bro, every which angle? Let's just review here, right? It's been like an hour since I looked at my phone. TikTok? Instagram message. WhatsApp message. Discord. Tweets? Messenger message, MLB, two emails, and a text. Just relax. <laughs> Just relax. You know damn well I'm replying to, like, one of those. <laughs> Who are these? Record, get rid of the Discord one. Okay, I'll reply to my sister. Um, This one's Maria, I'll reply to that one. 
What are these tweets? Spurs? Yeah, I'm not bothered about that. They can go. TikTok. I'll, I'll watch the TikToks, actually. I like what my friends send me TikToks. That's like, I enjoy that. That's one of my favorite notifications to get is you have received a direct message from TikTok and then I open TikTok and I have a little look. I've, not even, I've like barely touched TikTok for like two weeks since I like started work and stuff. Even on my days off, I just like, I don't know. That's the, probably the biggest adjustment is, is like learning how to be productive with your time. Cause like I had so much time um, over the past like year or so of, of lockdown and, and stuff to just do nothing all the time, that it didn't matter when I did or didn't do stuff because I just had all the time in the world. Now I'm like, okay, I think we go down here. Cause like, you know, any opportunity, cause it's the best bit. Um, a frog. I, um, it wouldn't matter, right? But now it's like, first of all, I'm definitely not making the most, definitely not, have not been making the most of my days off for one. And for two, even like, like when I come home from work, I just like do nothing. Ah, like, oh, what did you do after work last night? What do you mean? That's why I need to like, I need to learn how to be productive. Like, I you come home and like edit a video or something, and then you know, now I'm like, oh, I want to come home and then just like eat and play Genshin and then go to bed as soon as I'm done with Genshin. You know what I mean? It's tough out here, man. I, I've not been productive at all. I've just had three days off, and I'm like, okay, well, I'm obviously not doing anything on Sunday. Because I'm trying to like recover my energy, right? I had football to watch, and then I had American football to watch, both of those things, and then that was about all I did. And in my head, I was like, I'm gonna prepare a load so I can like YouTube stuff, so I can do a bunch of YouTube stuff on Monday, and then Monday rolled around and I did fuck all. Monday rolled around, do some recording. Nope, moped, moped, moped all day, and then played Genshin with my friends. Watched Josh stream. That was good. I enjoyed that. And then played Genshin with my friends. Tuesday rolled around, last chance to record. I've moped. I've moped all day. Went to get groceries. Cool. Knew that needed to happen. So glad I got that done. Um, and then came home and then moped and then recorded one video and then ate and then recorded one video. And then now, after I've done with this, I'm going to go have a shower and then I think have a nap and then play Stardew, maybe? I don't even know if we're doing that tonight or tomorrow night or wherever. Maybe I'll play Genshin? That's three three days off, and I'm in for six days, and then people be like, oh, what'd you do with your weekend? What'd you do with your weekend? Don't have an answer, I'm afraid. Nothing. Nothing at all. Could have edited some TikToks. Could, could have edited one TikTok in three days. Would have been the easiest thing on the planet. Just one. Nope. Zero. And this boy thinks he's gonna, uh, gonna be a super a viral superstar one day. Bottoms up and the devil laughs. Okay, clap. Nope. Nope, you're an idiot. You're stupid. Big dumb idiot. Also, as I was talking, I thought of a bit to do. And was excited to share it. And then... Um, <clears throat> continued talking and forgot what I was going to say. So, that's awesome and cool. Fucker. This game's not fun. Right? Are we all on the same page about that? Maybe I need to like come back. I don't like. I don't think that, I didn't even make contact just now. Am I okay in the head, like mentally speaking? Yeah, I went to the supermarket and I uh, my earphones are fucked. They have been since May, but um, as long as I hold it in at the right angle, the right earphone still makes noise. So I refuse to buy new ones. Um, however. Fortunately, you've got to hold it in at the right angle, so they're fine for at home. Well, quote unquote, fine. Uh, I can't like listen to music on the commute because they're fucked. Um, however, today I was like, you know what? I'm sick and tired of not listening to music where I when I go places. So I was going to the grocery store. Obviously, that's like, isn't the commute not too bad? Because it's like, I don't touch my f f f like I don't touch my phone on the whole journey, like on the bus or whatever. I'll just, I just look out the window or whatever. But even if I, like, listen to music, like, I wouldn't put music on until I got on the bus anyway. Oh my god. We ran out of time. It was the first round and only 25 people, 26 people made it. That's insane. Have they made this harder? That was the first round and only 26 people made it. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Have they really made it harder? Throw a boy a bone! Jesus Christ, I'm never gonna win this stupid game. 
Um, it's like, by the time I get on the boat, it literally is like two songs. So it, I don't know if it's even worth it, right? So I was like, going to the supermarket, that's like, that's like 35 minutes. So I put a little playlist together, put the headphones on, go outside. It's raining, right? It's raining, where are the headphones? It's raining. Well, that can't do. I can't have my headphones breaking. My headphones are actually good. I've had them for like six years, right? So I go, look, I'm wearing a cap because I haven't had a shower yet because I literally just haven't had time. So I don't look at my hair too much. So I go and then I put the I put them on and then I put the hood on over. And I was walking around in public like this. I look like an astronaut. This is how I was walking around in public. Obviously, I had a jacket on over this and it was layered because your boy, your boy loves a layer when it comes to autumn and winter. Your boy loves a layer. Hoodless jacket, hoodie over the back or even a jacket. You know what? You know what? Even a jacket with a hood? Two hoods? I don't think it looks like that. I can, I'm kind of rocking with it. Although, like, all of my jackets. I'm looking at them now. Yeah, all three of the ones I wear with any sort of regularity don't have hoods. But, when it gets really cold and I get the big winter jacket out, that one has a hood. I'll be doubling up hoods. IDGAF. Call the fashion police, baby. They'll say, don't worry, we already know about him. Anyway, so I was walking around looking like an astronaut. Because it was one of those things. And I, I've, I, I've, I, I've talked about this before. I don't care. When it comes to fashion stuff, I just wear whatever like, I feel like wearing or feel like comfortable wearing. I don't, I, like, I just don't care at all about like what other people think or whatever. Um, I, I kind of dress like shit, right? But then people will be like, like, I only went to the grocery store. And people will be like, oh, you put, like, like jeans on and, like, a real jacket just to go to the grocery store okay fair enough but that's just like what i felt like wearing right for the most part i i, I really don't care i'll just i like i just i don't like dress particularly well or, like i just wear whatever right the today was prime example of that look i say that and then we'll go to the supermarket and put on like put like a real outfit together and probably you know i'm like look in the mirror i'm like yeah i look all right but that's what that's, that's what i mean like i say i don't care but like i, I still want to like like, I dress that way because, like, I, th you know, I feel like I, that's how, like, I, I, I wear the clothes I think I'd look good in, right? Not that suit me. So I'll still look in the mirror, and then I like, like, that's how, when I, how I feel, like, the most comfortable, right? Like, people can be like, oh, I just care about, like, utility and wear, like, the comfiest clothes. I, I'm, I'm rocking with that for sure. Okay, that time it was just really easy. I'm rocking with that for sure. But, like, I still have that element of, like, I, I also, like, I feel most comfortable when I also, like, wearing clothes that suit me, if that makes sense. Um, or, or, or wearing clothes in my style. Um, so I'm just listening. I can't hear a car in front, but there was a truck blocking our drive. A massive truck. Massive, massive truck. And it, the truck was big, but then, like, the the back of it was down, and they had ladders sticking out in the back. So, like, it was as long as it could put, and it was just in front of our drive. Because um, that's just how I feel, like, I don't know. Is what it is, right? It's whatever. I forgot where I was going with this bit. Today was like the epitome of that though, because I was like, I, I put the headphones on and then went outside and there was like light rain and I went, right, do I take them off and just have no music because my earphones are fucked? Do I pull my hood up and protect my head and then wear them over the hood? Because that's fine. I do that at home all the time and I'm like, but then the headphones are still going to get wet. And when you know what? This hoodie is massive. This is the biggest hood I own because it's like super exclusive, crazy, mega secret merch. It's Drake merch from the Drake concert that I went to, but it was the secret merch that wasn't on the merch store. You could only get it if you knew about it and asked for it, but they only did extra large. Now, I like oversized clothing because I'm insecure about my body um, and also because I think it looks good. So I'm rocking with it. This one, though, it's, it's just it's massive right i'm i'm fine with it i'm rocking with it i like the oversize like you can look looking at me right now it probably looks it looks huge on me right just from looking at this like webcam like this and you can't even see the whole thing right you can just see my shoulders it's a big hoodie so the hood is also big so i'm like this is gonna you know what i happen to be wearing my big hoodie today this will go over the headphones and then i pull, pulled it up and without even looking at myself i went I look like a spaceman right now. I can tell. I can tell. I can tell I look like a spaceman. And I said, you know what? Bonk. Nope. That's fine. 
I may look like a spaceman. Maybe the school children will judge me because it was like 3 p.m. So all the school kids were coming out. And I forget every fucking time and every time I go over groceries, I get caught in the wave of the school kids coming over the bridge. I mean, maybe the school kids will judge me. You know what? At the end of the day, only one opinion matters. Only one can judge me, and that is the Lord himself. Because as long as I'm having a good time listening to my deaf tones and Mitski. Because that was the thing, I had a Mitski song stuck in my head. I wanted to listen to the Mitski song. Maybe I look a bit funny while I'm doing it. But you know what? I'm, my ears are having a party. Actually, they were a bit sad because I was... Um, it was one of those, I just, I didn't feel like putting anything in particular, so I made a tiny little playlist for the journey. And it, I went from, direct, you've received a direct message on TikTok, baby, shall we watch it together? Shall we watch it together? Who sent me something? Let's watch this together. Oh shit, I need to reply to Paul. Oh, sounds on, perfect. No, we don't need to worry about my few page. Just don't need to worry about what's going on in my few page. Um, Josh just sent me a TikTok. Sometimes I, sh maybe I shouldn't play it in a video, because it might be. Oh yeah, actually, like I recognize the username. Uh, maybe I'll watch that in between, but also I might not play that in a video. That's the guy. Um... <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I'll watch that after. Actually, I'm gonna watch that one after. Throw your dirty shoes in my washing machine, hot baby, bang it up inside. That was me pogging on the on the grocery store, and then I was listening to um. It's Thursday, I don't care about you, it's Friday, I'm in love. Yeah, that song is supposed to be happy. I didn't even, like, register that that was supposed to be a happy song. I've heard it before, and, like, it's obvious, I get it. But I was listening to it the other day, and I was like, this makes me really fucking sad. Because <laughs> it's, like, so specific to my situation right now. Actually, we don't need to go into this too much. But I realized recently, my I'm not going to have, like, weekends anymore. Because I am an idiot and don't have any foresight and didn't think about how shifts at a casino might affect my social life. Um, and now I'm trapped in hell. Not really. Being a little bit dramatic. Uh, for anyone who doesn't know, uh, Friday I'm in Love by The Cure is what I was singing. Although I was actually listening to Phoebe Bridges' version. Um, yeah, yeah, go ahead. No, you're here first. It's fine. Yeah, good jump, idiot. Okay, so the stuff, the sludge is like right there, so let's just, I forgot you can jump here. Okay, the sludge is right there, so let's just relax. The sludge is right there. You fucking are so dumb, it hurts. Um, now the song's nice because he's like, uh, Monday, Tuesday, it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday is all great. Thursday, I don't care. It's Friday, I'm in love. Because he's going through the week and he's like, Monday's shit, Tuesday's shit, Wednesday's shit, Thursday's shit, and then it gets to Friday and you get that Friday feeling and you're so excited that it's the weekend. It's supposed to be a happy song. <laughs> and I was listening to it and I was like, I was like, holy fuck, this is speaking out my exact situation. He's, he's, he's rubbing it, they're rubbing it in right now. I'm like s s sad about that exact happening. And then I'm just like letting Spotify shuffle and it's like, you like The Cure? Yeah, a little bit. It got some good songs. Probably haven't delved into them as much as I'd, I'd like to potentially, but they got some good songs. And it's funny because The Cure are like, a lot of their songs are so like mopey and sad. It's probably one of the happiest, most upbeat songs they have. But it's too specific. It had me feeling, <laughs> it had me feeling really sad. And then today I was listening to Phoebe Bridges' version, which probably doesn't help because she only makes sad music. Yeah. <sighs> It's Friday, I'm in love. Good song, though, by the way. Excellent song. I feel like... Well, it's, it's like a funny little, like, subcategory. It's not even a real category, because that's not the intention, but of, like, happy songs that just make you feel sad. If that makes sense? And, and I, I, I'm, like, weird with stuff, because I'll just get, like... Like, stuff will just catch me up all, all, all the time. Um... And the playlist they have at work drives me crazy because th th there's no, it's so back and forth. They'll play some happy songs and stuff and they'll play some, but they'll just play some really sad songs. And if I'm like, like I'll be re getting ready for a shift and just feeling like shit, feeling like really sad about everything. It's happened in front of, before every shift so far. I don't know why I just get really fucking sad. As the day goes on, I'm fine. But the two hours before and then like the first two or three hours of the shift, I'm just like, I am sad. So then I'll be in work and then it happened the other day. I'm sure, I'm sure, I'm sure they have Phoebe Bridges in their playlist. 
Yeah, but then they'll just put like a random song and I'll just be like, oh yeah, I'm sad now. Like the other day they were playing um, Use Somebody by Kings of Leon came on. I love that song. And then, but then I just was like, I'm going to cry on, uh, at this bar. I'm just going to be crying. Like, wh why do we have to play sad songs? But anyway. Uh, I'm trying to think of another example. Um, Don't Dream It's Over. And that one, again, it's supposed to be like uplifting or like have a good like positive message. It just kind of makes me sad. It just kind of makes me think of like, like, sad, like good things coming to an end. I don't like things coming to an end. Obviously, we I, I like I don't, I don't like change, and it's kind of like a similar ballpark. But like, like I'll just randomly get nostalgic for like a random moment that happened like six months ago, and then just be sad that it isn't that exact moment anymore. So I'm like. Like, I don't like nostalgia or, like, reminiscing. It just makes me sad because I just think that it isn't that happy moment anymore. There's going to be more happy moments, but, like, I don't know. And now you just sort of start to think about life, and as life goes on, those moments become fewer and far between. People get busier. You know? So when, when Crowded House or, like, Don't Dream is over, I'm like, I don't want it to be over, dude. I don't want it to be over, though. Anyway. Um... We'll never let them win, or they, they they won't win. Hey now, hey now, no jeep is over. Hey now, hey now, so hey, they build a wall between us. We'll never let them win. Did you say we'll never let them win? And they won't, we won't let, they, and they won't let some, I don't know, whatever. This is positive, I think. <laughs> anyway, that's a great song, by the way. Okay. So, um, we're gonna win this Fall Guys game. Speaking of... Not Fall Guys, actually. I don't know why I said speaking of, because I wasn't about to say any more about Fall Guys. Maybe man, it up. Even though I close my eyes, I know you bitten man. Hey, idiot, just don't listen to sad music, forehead. <laughs> yeah, you wanna see my, like, most... My, my recent... On Spotify? And then... Tell the algorithm algorithm to stop playing me sad music. It doesn't know anything else. <laughs> it doesn't know better. Actually, it was a fallout. Fallout boy. It was like a semi embarrassingly one of my favorite bands, but I keep coming back to them in like little phases. I'll listen to them a bunch for like two weeks, and then don't listen to them for six months, and listen to a bunch for two weeks. Let's have a look at my recent. Let's have a look at my recent. Um. Okay. Deftones. A lot of sadness in there. Um. Currently paused. Cynical one. My TV girl, yep. Um, recently played, let's have a look. That Funny Feeling by Phoebe Bridges, yep. C418, I can tell you immediately, it's because I was listening to Sweden and being sad. Jump Back In, first thing on the list, the my sad playlist. Um, and then Demi Devil, that's appropriate. Recently played, yeah, see all. I'm, I'm, click I'm clicking see all. Okay, what have we got here? What my friends been listening to? Wow, crap. <laughs> Actually, um, I don't know, like, any of these songs that my friends have been listening to, so it's, uh, I, I cannot judge. Although I opened Spotify earlier, and my, it was paused on Smack That by Akon, because I listened to it last, last night before I went to bed, and, uh, I opened up my Spotify, I turned my PC on, and Spotify opens on launch, uh, and it was, and, uh, my good friend Spink, her last song that she listened to was Smack That by Akon, and I went, wow, what a little hive mind moment. Last song I listened to before I went to bed, last song she listened to, um, as of about two hours before I turned my PC on. Isn't that a nice little moment? Um, what else is in the recent? I'm trying to look at the art. Okay, just focus, just focus on these jumps. I think the videos are recorded after this, and if you can't tell, I, I, I'm, I'm tired, which is stupid, because this is only my second video. Whoa, I just opened Spotify and Maria started playing a song. It's Cafe Music BGM channel. Yep, that makes sense. That makes sense. And she's teaching her children. She's allowed to listen to... What the fuck is this? Okay, also freeze dance was an absolute bop, so like, 
Yeah, I, I maintain, I've said this before. Okay, I've said this before, that Maria has elite music taste and definitely the best music taste of probably any of my friends. <laughs> Just relax. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Okay. <laughs> no, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Um... Can I play this? Will I get in trouble if I play this? Let's have a look. Uh, who really cares about TV if girl is probably the only album I've listened to recently. Um, oh, there you go, one of Maria's playlist. Uh, Iris by the Goo Goo Dolls. Oh yeah, I put Iris on and just let it play the radio and it just kept giving me songs about like people dying. It doesn't even make sense because Iris is a love song. <laughs> but then I've got like both of the two Frey songs that are popular that are both about suicide and then I got like, I can't remember what was coming on but every song was just sad. I got Everlong. I remember that came on, I was like, Poggy, good song, good song, but that's about divorce. Uh, Michael Jackson, Stardew Valley soundtrack, Binding of Isaac soundtrack, De Mod Deftones, Mitski, Claro, Soccer Mommy, Iron Maiden, Iron Maiden, Fru Fru, More Claro, Teen Suicide, Mitski, Ashnika, Thunder, 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 Kanye, Jay Z, Ashnika, Ashnika, Daphne, AJ Tracy. Hey, no, it's not too bad, actually. Okay. My bad. My bad on that one. My bad. What a save! My bad, though, on the first goal. It was alt tab. That's my bad. Sorry, sorry, I was watching football. Except not, because that's the whole point. And I wasn't doing it. Look at him, just lose. Look at him lose. Okay, what a fucking save, you holy shit. That was. Okay. That was. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay relax. No, you fuck. You fuckers. Oh, you, we're all so bad. Oh, we scored one. Dude, don't touch me. Don't touch me. You stinking pandemic, asshole. Have some respect. Have some respect. What the fuck is there's a pandemic going on, dickhead? No, okay, claw it back. Okay. No, fucker. Eat my ass. It doesn't even make sense. Why are we getting bullied? It's just. No, no, not two of them. Um, hello? Why did Spotify just stop playing Super Massive Black Hole in the background? <laughs> Pause that one before this video gets blocked. Actually, uh, no, Muse is fine. Fuck off! It's a fucking pandemic. <laughs> okay, no, it's fine, whatever. Yeah, you know what? I'm going rogue. I don't give a fuck. JK, I, I would n never do this deliberately. A good goalkeeper never is. Reese Well Neuer. Manuel Reese? Reese? I think. Uh, never mind, actually. I was about to say, like, a needlessly hot heart take, and it wouldn't have even made sense, because I don't think anyone watching this even watches football, so I don't even need to, like, put myself in the hot water for no reason. In fact, you know what? I'm going to say it, because no one watching this video watches football. I think Hugo Lloris right now is... I think current Hugo Lloris is better than current Manuel Neuer. I think Neuer is far enough past his prime that he's not that good anymore. I think he is top ten in the world still, but... I think he is like in towards the end towards the lower end of the top 10 in my opinion and I think Hugo Lloris is still just about above him also far past his peak but anyway um should we end it how long has it been maybe bang it up because I need to record another video fucking hell man 33 minutes this boy's been talking shit for half an hour I think I watch him I, I want to win this game so bad, and we will. What episode are we on now? 16? Damn, that would have been a final. Thank you guys for watching, for sticking with me. I'm going to go record a weird tier list, because I like doing those. Mwah. Bonk.